Hello and welcome to the video version of my journal. I'm Stephanie Rivers. When I signed up on Facebook about four months ago, I really didn't know what to expect. If it was anything like my MySpace experience, let's just say it was going to be forgettable. Well, after a year of being on MySpace, I only had one friend. I remember when I first realized I had one friend, I told my coworker, Hey, I've got one friend. He said, Who is it, Tom? I said, Yeah, how'd you know? He said, Tom started MySpace. He's everybody's friend. Well, it's a wonder if I got over that emotional experience um, and had the courage to join Facebook, but I'm glad I did because all my friends were waiting for me on Facebook. I now have 70 Facebook friends. Most of them are from high school and college, but I've been able to talk with people I haven't talked with in years and it sparked me to um, start to plan my high school reunion for next year so I'm really glad I did. Now some people say um, they have rekindled romantic relationships because of meeting old flames on um, Facebook and it spawned a new class of people called retrosexuals. They say they like the idea of having a fling with an old lover because it's safe and it's kind of like going on a blind date, but not. You know enough about the person's history, but there's at least a 10 year blind spot to fill in the blank. So it makes it exciting. Now I'm a firm believer in the adage, let sleeping dogs lie. So the most that I've done as far as looking up old flames is just to see if they're still alive. Um, but imagine my surprise about a month ago when one of my old boyfriends contacted me asking me to be his Facebook friend. I haven't seen him since 1991-ish and so we grew up together kind of. I moved to North Carolina to be with him while he was in the military and so I'm very excited about hearing about his family and how he's been doing and his parents and sisters. So um, I look forward to talking with him. We've only messaged each other a couple of times and we've talked not even yet have we talked. But when we do, I know there won't be any um, rekindling of any flame because I'm happy with my life and happy with my current relationship. So when we finally get a chance, I know that it will just be a great conversation. Still, I consider him to be um, a friend, um, not just on Facebook, but in life. Uh, because even though it didn't work out, we still learned a lot from each other. But for those of you who can't resist um, starting a Facebook uh, or re rekindling a Facebook romance, I would caution you um, against living in the past. You know, you might be able to um, know that this person is not a serial killer, but probably those same issues that caused the relationship to end in the first place probably are still there. Um, and probably will be a bigger thorn in your side than they were then. So just beware. Have fun, but beware. To find out more about the things that I care about, go to the written version of my journal at eurweb.com. Thanks, and have a super day.